Well, tis the season we see high weight and airport traffic increase as travelers head out for Christmas. So with the most wonderful time of the year here, how can it very quickly become the most stressful time at the airport and in our vehicles? News 19's Cassidy Bayer has more on this year's holiday travel. In terms of road traffic here on the holidays, I'm currently standing on the eastbound side of I-26 at a rest stop where folks are saying traffic isn't too bad right now. However, when they approach certain areas, specifically with construction zones, it tends to pick up right about there. Going to Charleston and because they're doing road work, they had it down to one lane and for probably a good 12 miles before the one lane, the traffic was all backed up. As 2023 winds to a close, holiday travel will be slightly more crowded between Christmas and New Year's compared to last year. In its annual end of year forecast, the AAA is projecting that 115.2 million Americans will be on the move over the holiday travel period. 26, we got 20, we got 77. It's a lot of travelers. Uh, even today, the traffic is just atrocious today. People doing last minute shopping. We just tell people be patient, uh, plan, uh, be prepared, and make sure your car's in good shape. You know, you don't want to have your car break down and you get stranded on the road. So we ask people to just. Just be prepared when they go out traveling. Know what you're going to do, where you're going to go, and always have safety in the forefront. Helena Bowman manages the rest stop at mile marker 122 on I-26 in Calhoun County. She says although things have been going relatively smoothly, in case of higher volume instances, safety is the top priority. We just try to make sure that EMS and all emergency vehicles can get through. Um, we try to keep the parking lot open as much as we possibly can to keep it clean for them, um, just to kind of make it more easy for them to keep going. In the sky, AAA estimates 7.5 million holiday travelers will fly, which makes this year the busiest ever for Christmas travel, surpassing 2019's record of 7.3 million passengers. However, on Friday at the Columbia Metropolitan Airport, lines were short and chaos was minimal. Monday and Tuesday were very hectic and it's kind of quiet. We're on a, a, a shortened or a limited flight schedule for this for the remainder of the week. Although there isn't a huge influx of people with the modified flight schedule, the Columbia Airport still insists passengers are more cautious about their timing. In a statement to News 19, they wrote things will be busy and to advise people, arrive early, keep an eye on your flight status through airline mobile apps, and pre-book your parking to ensure a smooth and easy travel experience. Sheriff Lott says everyone can join law enforcement to make sure things are safe out there. If you're going to travel, put some extra time in your travel plan so in case you do encounter traffic, so you're not stressed out uh, over the traffic and being delayed. You know, we need to enjoy it. Just have a good holiday season. Reporting from Columbia, Cassidy Byer, News 19 WLTX. Well, AAA says Saturday, December 23rd, so tomorrow, and Thursday, December 28th, will be the most congested days on the road and advise all travelers to use extra caution during those times.